Welcome everybody, this is going to be my top 10 bugs for all you bug heads out there. Let's just jump right into it. Number 10 is going to be the earwig. Um, so I think we can all agree that earwigs are one of the more disturbing species inside the bugdom. Uh, the idea that this guy wants to crawl through my ear into my head and lay eggs uh, near my brain is very alarming. Uh, the reason they ended up edging out the competition and making the list is because these bad boys are fast as hell, and I've never been able to catch one. Number 9, Silverfish. Although I consider myself somewhat of a bug expert, I honestly had no idea this was a real species. If you've ever played Minecraft, you probably just think they were annoying assholes that interrupt mining expeditions, but they are indeed a real bug, and for that I had to give them the 9 spot. Number 8, Human Lice. Now these little guys are great. They're almost undetectable, and they like to latch onto our heads with their vacuum-like mouths and just suck away. They enjoy laying thousands of eggs in our hair as well. Number 7. Conehead Termites Now, I'm a major termite fanboy. I've always been captivated by their teamwork and ability to coordinate attacks on our homes and other structures. These little guys would eat your whole house if you let them. Coneheads stand above the others within the termite family due to their brown cone-shaped heads that I like a lot. Number 6. The Asian Giant Hornet. Wow! Look at the size of this guy. He's like a regular hornet, but big. Number 5. Millipede. Unfortunately, these bugs do not live up to the name and only have about 300 legs and not 1 million, which is very disappointing, and I believe a name change is in order. Again, the fact that they don't even have 1,000 legs, never mind 1 million, is absurd, and whoever chose this name should be taken care of. Um, that being said, still a fucking lot of legs, which is why I gave them the number 5 slot. Number 4, Scorpion. Uh, these things are just hardcore as hell and will just fuck your day up. I just like their reckless attitude and the fact that they're just not afraid to fight. Number 3, Pill Bugs. Uh, I can't quite explain my obsession with these guys, but what I will say is that they're known as a primary companion bug amongst most bug heads and bug experts. Um, they're surprisingly soft and cute, and they like to communicate with their human masters by rolling into a ball and performing somersaults and various stunts. So, sorry guys, in my book, pill bugs are far superior to mammals like dogs and cats. Number two, ladybug. Uh, again, the name does not do these beauties justice, as I find women very bossy and loud, whereas a ladybug is docile and a soft creature with a gorgeous pattern. And number one, the cockroach. Uh, this is pretty self-explanatory in my opinion, um, as a nuclear blast has no effect on them, and they're born survivors with extreme endurance and perseverance, and they will find a way into your home and they will uh, replace you as the primary homeowners and there's nothing you can do about it. Roaches have got it all. They're intelligent, durable, strong, and fast as hell, which makes them the ultimate bug.